Hi, well Chris here today with a video to show you the difference between a slot mask CRT and an aperture grill CRT, both from 34cm colour television receivers. So on the left here we have the slot mask, which is a slot mask for those of you who don't know, it's just a it's a um, form of shadow mask. A shadow mask is generally consists of small round holes. Um, which, those are generally found in early colour televisions and computer monitors. In televisions, however, for better brightness, um, they use slots which, which are arranged vertically, and they, they just allow more brightness through, and, yeah, um, when they when both tubes are off, because you can't see the, um, slot mask, they both look like aperture grills, but, um, Here's an easy way to tell them apart. As you'll see, as you can kind of see here, the um, slot mask CRT is curved both vertically and horizontally, whereas the um, aperture grill CRT is curved only horizontally. This is because of um, the aperture grill, which are tiny, thin wires running across. These allow for better brightness, but um, they need they can only be held on a curve like that. You can't you can't have them on a double curve like with a slot mask CRT. And because of that, because the CRT's only got one curve, it needs to be thicker. The faceplate needs to be thicker to withstand the um, pressure. So that's why aperture grill CRTs are always only curved on one direction like that on the horizontal direction so now for some more differences um, as you can see the um, aperture grill has a um, longer neck and it also has a more bulbous body to it, a more bulbous cone but with um, all the smaller with the smaller slot mask CRTs they kind of have a more compact tube with aperture grill ones they're generally more bulbous like this and then of course you've got the long neck with um with extremely long electron gun assembly as opposed to um regular CRT like this which has a shorter one so um aside from that that's just um those are just the main ways of telling the two tubes apart um without actually running them and taking a look at the screen with a magnifying glass so there you have it I just thought I'd quickly show you that so cheers Chris